Here we introduce tools for helping the adoption of full body avatars in virtual reality applications. The tools are part of our RUIS toolkit for Unity, dealing with the following topics. Scaling of avatar body segments, joint use of different motion tracking systems, and convenient features for quickly deploying arbitrary humanoid avatars. If the avatar's body segment lengths match those of the user, then the user's own body can provide visually consistent haptic feedback. Hence, we are interested in adjusting the avatar's proportions with the user in mind. Simple positioning of joints by motion capture input gives a very little leeway before the avatar mesh suffers from obvious self-intersections, regardless of how well the skinning is done. Therefore, scaling of the body segments is required. Here our toolkit applies uniform scaling on the arm segments based on the input from a simulated motion capture system. In this example we see our approach working with real-time mocap data. Adjusting the placement of the hip markers changes the mocap system's perception of the user and our avatar conforms to this automatically. The drawback of using uniform scaling is that it affects body segment thickness alongside with its length. Therefore, we implemented automatic non-uniform scaling for limbs. The use of non-uniform scaling allows independent control for body segment thickness. Each limb has its own thickness parameter. The overall torso thickness can also be adjusted. These open up interesting possibilities for body modification. Usually the body shapes of avatars are adjusted via blend shapes, which are commonly created by 3D artists alongside with the avatar model. Our approach of avatar transform hierarchy scaling is that it is applicable to all avatar models while not requiring additional blend shapes. Besides automatic body segment length scaling and coarse grain thickness parameters, our toolkit allows adjusting all body segments individually. This can be used to create various versions of the same base avatar. The biggest downside of non-uniform scaling is the distortions it causes to child transforms. Additional skew is introduced at oblique angles, which at the moment is unavoidable. The RUIS toolkit allows combined use of various virtual reality devices, both consumer and professional ones. When two or more different motion tracking systems are to be used together, their coordinate systems need to be aligned with a special calibration process. Here is a simple example of combining a professional motion capture system with two different consumer grade sensors. All the devices seen here were aligned to use a shared coordinate frame. The calibration process can be used to align any two sensors that are capable of inputting position tracking data to Unity. The process itself is very straightforward. The tracked devices of different origin are to be held close together and moved within the joint tracking volume. After a predetermined number of position sample pairs are collected, a 3x4 transformation matrix between the two coordinate frames is sold and saved to an XML file. Here is an example of a consumer-grade VR system used together with a professional motion capture setup. Even without haptic effects from virtual objects, a full-body interaction that utilizes physics simulation in virtual reality is always a lot of fun. Finally, we demonstrate how simple it is to use our toolkit to create a new full-body avatar from a rigged 3D model. The only limitation is that the avatar must be a biped. A script from our toolkit needs to be added to the avatar game object. If Unity recognizes the animation rig correctly, then the body segments can be found automatically with a push of a button. When using Kinect there are no further steps to take, and the avatar is ready to be used. Thank you for your attention.